Greetings to you all. Well, this year was not exactly how we thought we would be celebrating our 40th year. COVID-19 has challenged us and the whole world to adjust our plans. Responding to the call of our mission, our priority has and always will be to ensure continuity of quality services to those we serve, while keeping our clients, foster carers, staff and volunteers safe. You've all worked tirelessly to ensure that happens. Throughout COVID, we have been able to transition and adjust with minimal impact on delivery of our services, and we should all be very proud of that. Throughout the pandemic, our staff working in clients' homes have continued providing these essential services. Our teams based in schools initially had to make a major pivot to offer much needed services to students through digital means, and later returned to face-to-face -face services when this became possible. Other services have had to adapt to new modes of delivery through online means. And many of our staff have moved to an extended working from home situation. This adaptability at a time of significant challenge is great testimony to the skill and dedication of you all. Traditionally, we would have announced the recipients of our staff awards at the staff Christmas party. As a Christmas party was not possible this year, I would like to congratulate and thank all who received a service award for 5, 10, 15 and 20 years service. Thank you so much for your dedication and commitment. For Christians around the world, Christmas is a time of joy, hope and celebration as we reflect upon the significance of the birth of Jesus. We know in our work at Catholic Care and in our own lives that this time is not one of joy for everyone especially those who are lonely or suffering. We are mindful of both the celebration and joy that is part of this season, along with compassion for those experiencing tough times. This year has been challenging in so many ways. Now that Christmas is approaching, I hope you enjoy a well-deserved break. And it's a special time of connection with loved ones. I thank you all for your wonderful contribution to the work of Catholic Care and the people we serve. I'm truly privileged to serve as your director and I look forward with anticipation and confidence to what 2021 will bring. I wish you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.